Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm going to be making a video about some things that you can actually do on the day of Tales of Tenorio's release, which is in a week from when I'm making this, that will set you up to have the best release experience possible. So, let's get right into it. So, the first thing I would highly suggest you do is to do any chores slash tasks you need to do on the day before Tales of Tenorio drops. And this is because, so you don't have, you know, any distractions or anything you have to do that will get in the way of your Tales of Tenorio experience. And all of your focus can be just on Tales of Tenorio and nothing else that gets in the way. The next thing I would like to suggest you could do is getting on a VC with some friends and checking out the game together. Especially if you're all playing in some kind of unison. If you guys all get to experience it at like the same time, it's just going to be such a memorable experience that you can recollect on later. And personally for me, it will elevate the experience to a whole nother level than what it could have been if you played on your own. So, if there are any friends you have who are interested in the CC genre, get them on Tales of Tenorio on February 17th and have an amazing time. And if you can't get on with any friends, then the next best alternative is watching a streamer. Watching a streamer can be quite an interesting experience because, you know, you get to see another POV of the game and just have someone and a chat to talk to. And a little heads up, I will be streaming Tales of Tenora on release, so if you are interested in me personally streaming, I will see you then. But anyway, just watching someone else play and interacting with them could be just another cool way to elevate your release experience. So if that does appeal to you, then give it a go. As for the last thing I would like to talk about in this video, Although it kind of does oppose my previous point, it's still a really interesting and good way of experiencing the game. And that is going in completely blind. So switching off Twitter, YouTube, just anything where spoilers could come out from and taking the game at your own pace and style. This is obviously a really cool way of playing through the game because you get to experience anything for yourself as good as day with no one else to influence. All the choices will be made by you and you just get to go along in your own way and do what you like. So that's probably gonna be it for this video. If you guys are gonna be using any of these, then let me know in the comments and spread the word so others can get a feel how they wanna be playing Tales of Tenorio and just making their release experience better. So yeah. I don't normally do this, but according to YouTube, 94% of viewers are not subscribed. So if you want to make that number a lot less, then make sure to subscribe because a bunch of Tales of Tenorio content is coming your way. And I will see you in another video. Goodbye!